Hi guys and welcome to our physics series. Today we have a specimen 2023 paper 4 question 2. Part A complete the definitions by giving the name of each quantity. For the first one mass times acceleration which is according to Newton the second law of motion equals force. For the second one force times time equals impulse. So get two marks, one mark for the force and one mark for the impulse. Section B, figure 2.2 shows a man using a golf club to hit a ball. The ball has a mass which is 0.046 kilogram. And the golf club is in contact with the ball for a duration of 5.0 times 10 power by negative 4 seconds. And the ball leaves the golf club at a speed of 65 meters per second. So this is velocity. And I calculate the momentum of the ball as it leaves the golf club. Momentum is or equal to mass times velocity. Okay. The simple of momentum is P and equals to the mass simple by M times V, which is velocity. The third point, MP equals the M 0 0.046 times 65 for the velocity. It gives us finally 3.0 and kilogram for the unit of mass and velocity, which is meter per second. So the kilogram meter per second is the unit of momentum. So you get two marks. One mark for the final correct answer with the unit and the substitution. For double I, calculate the average resultant force acting on the ball while it is in contact with the golf club. To find out the force, so just to remind you, the impulse equals to the change in momentum. And one more point, the impulse equals to the force times the time taken. But the question is, why we, we mentioned that the impulse equals to the change of momentum? Because I'm trying to link the double I to I. The change in momentum in the previous step was 3, so which is the value of the impulse, and equals to the force here, which is unknown value, times the time taken, which is 5 times 10 power by negative 4. You can divide out, divide both sides by 5 times 10 power by negative 4. It gives us finally 6,000 and the unit of the force, which is Newton. So you get two marks here, one mark for showing the, the calculation and one mark for the correct answer with the unit. There is a, another way to find out the force. F equals the change in momentum, so M times V minus U for the change in velocity divided by the time taken. And this formula simply, it's a Newton second law of motion. If you think about the V minus U for the change in velocity divided by the time, it gave us the acceleration. For this reason, the examiner asked you for this point, but in the previous part in I, when he was asking for the mass times acceleration is what was what? So it's force. In a way, the force equals to, it's easy to substitute this one as well. There's another way to find out the value of the force. 0 0.046 for the mass times the velocity or the change in velocity is 65 and divided by the time taken, which is 5 times 10 power by negative 4. It's going to give us the same final answer. Finally, triple I, while the golf club is in contact with the ball, the ball becomes compressed and changes shape. State the type of energy stored in the ball during its contact with the golf club. This ball, at this moment, there is slightly, there is a change in shape, or the, it's already deformed. So there's only one energy stored inside, or you could say that it's a kind of potential energy. So this is the this type of energy we have, we have a name for this, which is the elastic energy or spin energy. So finally, you get the last one, 
mark and seven out of seven. Thank you for watching. And if you have any question, please do not forget to write in the comment and share and like and subscribe. Thank you.